greetings from Malta. We current we just um, got the ferry across the ferry this morning across from Syracuse, sorry from Sicily, Pozzalo to Malta here. Just arrived at a hostel. It is hot, but it's like a dry hot. Whereas in Sicily, I was sweating from places I didn't know I could sweat from, like my shins my palms like in between my fingers i was dripping here at least um it's a bit of a bit more of a dry heat here thank god now we're here in malta my mate dill from london's coming as well soon um she's gonna rock up in a sec uh and yeah we've got four days here i feel like it's gonna be four jam-packed days because there's quite a bit to do so today um i think we're gonna now that we've showered changed checked into our hostel we're gonna head out to medina the old town and then we're going to we have time we're gonna go see Valletta this evening um, hopefully fingers crossed sunset swim because it is hot um, and I know Dill is keen for a swim as well as usual um, I feel like we're both on the same page um, and then tomorrow we have tomorrow or the day after we're either gonna we're gonna do Gozo Island and also this Fisherman's Bay I need it I can't remember the name Fisherman Town Bay and then there's St. Peter's swim spot that's right near the Fisherman's Town. So we're going to do that as well for one of the days. And then tomorrow evening, we're hoping to go to a beach club. Um, hopefully it's a vibe. And then on Monday, we've got a boat, like a full day boat cruise out to Blue Lagoon, which I think will be really nice. I no plans for that evening. And then the day after that, we've got another free day. So it'll be one, either Gozo Island or Fisherman's Bay. And then... And then there's a jazz and sushi night that me and Dill are really keen on sussing out as well. It's so random, but it sounds really cool. And where better to do it than here in Malta? Um, yeah, and then our final day, and that'll be our final day. No, and then we've got one more day. I think we have one more day. Anyways, we have four days. I'm totally lost on what we're doing each of these days. I feel like I don't even know what day it is anymore. Anyways, I'll quickly show you guys what I'm wearing. I was in gym shorts and a tee. This Deji studio set on, which is super good for this hot weather. It's super breezy. Linen set. Look at my tee. All right, I gotta go. Bye. On my way to pick up Dill. Look, he's already headed to Valletta. Um, Dill's just running late. Her flight was delayed, but I'm heading to her hostel now to pick her up and then we're heading to Valletta for the afternoon. Probably walk around the town in Valletta and then this arbor will have a nice swim to cool down. See you guys later. The best is cotto e And then are all these ones the same at the bottom? Which one? This one's green peas. Green peas. It's vegetarian. Yeah. That's when I was like, how do I get that? <laughs> Mm, stuck with these two for the next four days. Kill me now. Yeah, she already had her feature. First 
just got off the bus a few too many stops earlier. We're just walking now in this 33 degree heat. It's been a long day. And it took us one and a half hours to get here on the bus. Should have been an hour bus ride. This morning we went to Marsalox. It's like a fishing village. And we're hoping to get like fresh fish fry. Except it was just a seafood market. <laughs> I'm just talking to Mr. Vlog, okay? I'm just giving him an update up today. Then we did end up going to St. Peter's Pool. Um, we got a water taxi, it ended up being super nice. Spent a couple of hours there and then meeting up with Dylan now in Medina, except it's taken us one and a half hours to get here because the bolt was too expensive. So then we went for the bus. Now nah, keep going straight. So it's almost five. We're meant to be in Medina at 4 p.m almost 5 p.m. Probably only get an hour to see Medina. I've got a beach club to go to tonight, which should be good. Um, so yeah, I'm really keen for some ice cream here in Medina. Starving it is so hot. Gone in and out. But you're it's Yeah, but it was still nice, like even when it was day here in Malta. Well, I look so sunburnt. Skin is a bit crispy um, at the moment. So Dylany, Lockie and I, um, we went to Gozo Island yesterday. I think it's been my favorite so far out of Gozo, Valletta and Medina. Um, just like the old town vibe. I loved Gozo. It was old fashioned cars, like those old utes. Um, really nice seaside town. Visited Slendy Bay as well and it would have been so nice for a swim but it was so choppy yesterday. The ride firstly, the ferry ride to Gozo was like one of my highlights. Questionable. It was like a theme park ride. It was absolute chaos. People were screaming um, and we were laughing hysterically and I was like crying laughing at the start and then towards the end me and Dil were literally sitting there in silence, eyes closed deep breathing because I thought I was actually going to vomit um, by the end of that ferry ride. Um, it was hilarious but looking back but oh my god I I can't remember the last time I don't even get seasick and I can't remember the last time I felt like that. Um, and we, It took a while to recover as well after we got off Gozo Island. I had to go get um, a lemonade and then Jill went and got some hot chips and Lockie got um, a burger as well because we just felt so sick for a while um, but yeah after that we went and saw the citadel that was beautiful last night we went to dinner at Nenu it was like an authentic Maltese restaurant in Valletta the old town <laughs> and that was really nice uh, today uh, I've just had a chill morning woke up just had a bit of a sleep in just showered freshened up and uh, we've got our sunset catamaran this afternoon and we're visiting Blue Lagoon. Hopefully we get a swim and it's not too choppy like it was yesterday. And it hasn't cancelled yet because our original catamaran, it was meant to be a day tour for yesterday, cancelled. We were in a period of mourning. Lockie was, Lockie was Devo. He was like in a complete state of mourning. For this Arbo's boat cruise. This peony set. Um, Velvet Canyon Sunnies and Lottie Hall 
um, linen pants. This morning, super tired. I'm up because Dylan and I committed to a sunrise swim. She's awake, confirmed. But I could almost go back to sleep if she didn't reply. I've only slept a couple of hours because I just went to bed late, like an idiot. Um, but she's on her way and then we're gonna walk about 20 minutes to St. Julian's Bay. Then go for a swim and watch a sunrise. That they would wash away so fast 